Oh, hi, everybody. I didn't see you there. Glad that we're uh, already rocking and rolling. My uh, compatriots on Skype can confirm that is the case, but no need to check. I know what I'm doing. And uh, let's get started. A lot of uh, bullet challenges already coming in, so let's, uh, let's just accept some of the first comers as far as that goes. Un momento, por favor. All right, here we go. We're going to play Greg Doodles. I bet Greg Doodles likes noodles. Yeah. <laughs> We're gambling today, by the way. We're gambling with my high rating. I've been playing some good bullet chess. That's a fact. The rating reflects that. <clears throat> but uh, a, lot of, a lot of my best bullet chess being played while I'm not multitasking the flavor, as I like to call it. Um, multitasking the flavor. That should be a hashtag. Hashtag multitasking the flavor. Um, okay. We've got... Alrighty then, that is an A2 pawn, which I will gladly capture. And with it comes threats of checkmate, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah. All right, well, let me back up and show Greg Doodles what he did wrong. Because everyone wants to learn from their games. Even this guy, believe it or not. How's the sound? Everybody's happy. Everybody's uh, everybody's doing great, I assume. Happy to be here. It is a Wednesday. It's hump day. That's why we do the bull brawls on Wednesday, I think. For my own personal therapy, it's hump day. And for you all, it's hump day. So we can get over that. Get over that hump. So I played a dragon. Um... And uh, d5 against nine castles long. Of course, uh, nine castles long, instead of bringing the bishop to c4, is uh, one of the main, uh, let's see, um, distinctions you can apply in this in these mainline Yugoslav attacks. And so black has a number of moves here, but d5 is the most principled approach. And normally what, black, what white wants to do is take here and then take on c6 first, and then uh, establish some sort of grip positionally. That There's a number of moves that have been played. Also, queen to e1 and king to b1 are both moves here. Uh, that have also been played. So you can check out all of them, but the main point is that taking on d5 is just not a good idea to bring my queen to threaten this a2 pawn. Probably if you play king to b1 instead, you're you're still doing okay. Um, not like black is just winning or anything, but I would likely prefer black after something like bishop to e6. I wonder if I can also play rook to d8, but after knight takes c6, I don't think it does much. I think I might even have to take with the pawn there, because if takes d2, he has takes e7 with a little svishenzug. That's right. If you're just joining me after watching the hashtag daily puzzle video over on YouTube, first of all, then you know that I'm still drinking that really long cup of tea and that I starred as Frightened Inmate number two, believe it or not. Look it up. If you don't get the Frightened Inmate number two reference, I, I don't know. I, I'm not happy with you right now. Not happy. All right. Uh, and that I'm fighting off a cold. So um, that's why I said we're gambling. We're here to gamble with rating points. You know why? Because that's what we do on chess.com. We risk it and get the biscuit. We go for it. Without great risk, you cannot have great success. I think that's true. You can have calculated risk, though. I mean, that's not like an excuse to throw caution to the wind and sack your queen every game, all right? All right, Kasparov, 2586. My nemesis. This is it. Let's see if we can battle here. Boomtown, peeps. Boomtown. I need to fix my mouse here. Ugh. Sorry. No excuses, I'm just trying to get comfortable. It's very important that I'm comfortable, in case you're wondering. Uh, not you, me. I, I would like to be comfortable. So that's my goal, is to be comfortable. Not in life. In life, I, I generally fear comfort. I think as soon as you're comfortable, by definition, you're, you're not growing. So I, I tend to fear comfort in life. Uncomfortableness is a part of the... Uh, Part of what it's all about okay let's back up uh let's bring this guy over red rover play b5 maybe even play there i'm not even too worried about the check although i will guard it now let's see if he wants it he wants it he wants the whole thing he's risking it he wants the biscuit i want the biscuit everybody wants the biscuit so uh that's what happens when everybody's going for the same thing I'm actually not even sure what to do with that. I'm going to try to bring my rook over to the F file 
That's my idea, yeah? And give a little check, right? Take it. Do it. Nice. You can't take a pawn because of check, yeah? That's nice. We're going to play there. Ooh, we're going to love that check. We are happy to trade those rooks, let me tell you that. All right, let me tell you that. He is population lost town right now. This is a rook ending that I am going to have a little bit of fun with. I can trade rooks and then uh, just play here. Remind him that he can't trade. All right, should be good enough for the old Winneruski. All right, that'll be one, I think. He resigns. Game on, people. Game on. If I blow my nose disgustingly during the show, you know, I don't know what to tell you. Always take the tea bag out of the tea. Otherwise, the tea bag is actually reabsorbing flavor. Hashtag pro tip. Did you know that? At least you can leave today's show like, oh, Danny was an idiot again, but I guess I learned something. You know what I mean? I mean, you would think that that would be on your priority list to learn. All right, let's do this, man. Let's rematch it out. Come on, Kasparov. I know you want the whole thing. I know you don't want to go down like that. I'm going to try to adjust town, my mouse town, really get comfortable. you got to settle in for a long winner's nap when it comes to a bullet show. Because if you're not comfortable, you will lose. It's Physical comfort is very, very important. Um, if uh, Margie, Zealand Zen, or Mike can confirm that everything is still good on the show, on Skype, I would appreciate that. Just, you know, updates from time to time. You know, when I get lost in my own world. Yeah, always appreciate that. Um, I was supposed to play e5 before knight f3, just in case you were wondering. I messed that up. So that's a fact. And now, now we have a not ideal position for me. But okay. We're going to take here first. Then we're going to play there. We're going to hope that Everything's going to be just fine. Every little thing is going to be all right. Wasn't that a 90s song? Every little thing is uh, something. Like, I feel like I should be able to sing something that has to do with every little thing being all right. That's how I feel. Uh, maybe that's every little thing she does is magic. I don't know. I'm confused now. Um, that wasn't ideal for me. I'm not playing well this game. I am not playing well this game, and I know it. All right? I get it. Lay off of me. And I'm losing on time as well. So it's not an ideal game for me at the mo, at the moment. I'm going to try to give a little check a ruski. Maybe go pawn taking. Maybe. That was not ideal either. Okay, well, this is not turning out to be the best of time for me. So he's going to strike back. The Empire strike back. Good for him, Kasparov. Who in the world happened there? Because it wasn't bad to start. What's the education? Oh, yeah, so this is the line I keep saying, that the move here is just e5, and white is like... Plus over minus. I always forget to play that in bullet, like every single time. I feel like I, I feel like I'm literally having a deja vu right now, literally. That everything I just said happened on live TV, and that I also missed it in those games as well. Classic me. Well, we got to play Kasparov a best of five. Now that he's got the momentum, I can't run away. Kasparov, if you're down, I'm down for Uno Mas. Actually, more than Uno Mas. Let's see what we can do here. See if we can get some magic to happen. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's all right with me. Some Oh, that's horrible for me, actually. That's not all right with me. This just went from bad to really bad. But he doesn't have anything, surprisingly. He has, he has nothing, in fact. Yeah. We just want to make sure that there's no fork town. Fort Town population, this guy, not happening today. I'm going to bring this other rook over. I'm going to bring this rook over to A5. You know why? Because I can. That's why. I'm going to bring it over here. I'm going to bring the noise and the funk right now. Really. 
I think he's going to be bringing that queen back momentarily. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he'll be delivering the goods. Hollywood. No, I think he, as as predicted, he's bringing that queen back. Play b5. I need to create some space. I need to create some space for the king. Okay. Whoa, that's mate, buddy. His king was already in trouble. But I had a trick, FYI, um, when I went for this whole thing. Um, I had a trick in mind that if he took h7 here, I was going to backdoor, backdoor boomtown, as I like to call it. All right, here we go. <sighs> See if we can take the series best of five right here, right now. Right here, right now. How now, brown cow? We're gambling. Oh, Verisoft town. Population you, bruh. Yeah, I'm just going to play it. Oh, he uh, he's okay with that, huh? Whoa, what's going on here? What's going on here? I never know what's going on here. All right, I guess we'll play that. That doesn't look so nice. Not really. What's going on here? This isn't good for him now. Oh, yeah, we are more than happy with that. That is a lot to do about goodness. That is a lot to do about goodness. I'm just going to play this. Get that pass pawn rolling. Uh, I guess I still have a bind. Oh, wow, I just totally messed this up. Way to go, Danny. Way to go, Danny. Way to go, idiot. Talking to myself here. Went from totally winning to being really fancy, and I deserve to blow it. <laughs> So there you go. That's life. That is life in the big city, as they say. And uh, we'll see. Okay, we'll see. Can I make something magical happen? Maybe. Is there anything magical happening here? Huh. No way to come around. All right. Well, I feel pretty bad about that because I let you off the hook, buddy. You escaped by the hair on your chinny chin chin, which is not very much, yeah? Not like my gross, has Danny even hit puberty yet facial hair? I know it's horrible. You guys don't have to tell me. I know. I'm, I'm horrified by my own facial hair. All right, I don't even need the comments. Like, oh, Danny, are you aware that you look like a $3 hangover. Are you aware of that? Like, yeah, I actually am. Okay, and thanks. Thanks for reminding me. All right. So, yeah. Now it's time to roll the king side. Keep them rolling. Like, uh, do I even care about that? I'm not even sure if I do. I'm not even sure if I do. Oh, but I did care about that, but he missed knight to c7. Now I get a 4. And I'm super excited. Uh, I don't want a queen trade. Because I would much rather checkmate you. But I guess I kind of have to, huh? Yeah. That's only slightly irritating. But he is down a bishop. He is down a bishop if you're keeping track at home. And I'm hoping to exploit such matters. I am hoping to exploit such matters. How do I exploit it? It's got to be winning for me here. He's basically down a piece. And that cannot be good for him. Um, I'll just take and take, I guess. Uh. Oh no, I just blundered my rook. Oh. Uh. 
No. What is he doing? He's he's pre-moving checks to trap me. No! Oh my god, it was made on the board! No! That was not a draw! That was made on the board! Kitten? Oh my gosh! I'm gonna take that one up with management, Holmes. Like, yo! Like, you gotta be kidding me. That was mate on the board. Wow. Hashtag frustrated. I still win the best of five, and I'm still gonna move on to another opponent, because there are many, many askers right now. Kasparov, dude, well played. Getting me to flag there. I know, I know not your best chess today. All right, a lot of people get intimidated when they're on the big the, the big lights, okay? All right, I understand. I'm not, you know, I'm not putting you down or anything. I just, I know that you'd probably play better against me if you knew that I wasn't, like, talking smack at the same time, right? Um, no, I'm kidding, but this is, but this is ridiculous. I should have just played faster. I was, like, so wor like, worried about time. Classic bullet po-fa, to tofu. What is that, a po-fa, a tofu? I think that works. Anyway, all right, we got we got many more, including the legend himself, Yakov N, but I'm going to make him wait. I'm going to take on Fide Master, Matty D. Perrine. Yo, yo, let's see if we can get something magical. I know Matty likes the Nimzo. Oh, not today. Not today he doesn't. Today he likes himself a good Queen's Indian, all right? And that's good. That's good for him. Let's, I don't know what I'm doing. I literally have no idea what I'm doing right now. So that happened, right? Whoa, town. Whoa, town. Yeah, that's a good move by him. I gotta go there. I've got to move quickly, yeah? And calculate what's going on with the pieces. Right, takes. Takes. Shake it. Nice. Get castled. Right. King over. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, right. Um, Let's go in there. Let's get nasty. Whoa, that just feels like he's asking for it. It really does, doesn't it? Am I the only one who feels that way? I'm going to take there. I'm going to go here. I'm going to take there. I guess he can do this, yeah. I guess he's doing just fine. And he's doing fine on time as well. So I have to be careful here. Okay, I don't... Whoa, I just put my knight on h3. Yeah, that just happened. That was silly. People are like, hey, Danny, do you know you just put your knight on h3? Like, yeah, actually, I am. I'm aware of that right now. Appreciate it. Appreciate the tip. Whoa. Get out of my house, dog. I'm gonna come in now. How now, brown cow? Oh, no. Just made it myself in one. Ah! Oh my god, that was silly. That was silly. Right after all the smack I was talking, that was just silly. All right, Maddie, you're welcome. Hashtag you're welcome. All right, that was that was silly beans. Right when the queen and knight were getting ready to do their to do their dirty, do their dirty work. We'll go here. Oops, don't move the king. Don't move the king. He says. All right. We like it. We're going to push it. We're going to push those pawns. Do I even care about that? Uh, hashtag not really. Um, whatever. I guess so. Kind of irritating. I really don't like playing moves like that. I really don't like it. Okay. 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 Move over. Oh, he just wants the queen trade, huh? He just likes to trade queens. Likes his chances better in the end game these days, huh? Understood on that. Actually, understood on that decision. Whoa. Okay, we'll go there. Um, go there. Oh, 
So that's a skewer. That hurt. Not fun, it is. There it is. There it is. Lawrence Fishburne style from Searching for Bobby's Fishes. Whoa. Wow, he did it. Hats off to him, not hat off to me. I knew what he was doing and I didn't even think about stopping it. All right, well, a game that should have been won, but you know what? Shoulda, woulda, couldas, and you know what excuses are like. So let's do this thing, right? This is, um, this is a showdown and I am losing rating points rapidly. See if he wants the Nimzo this time. He does. He does want himself a good Nimzo. Oh, I pre-moved that. That was a mistake. An accident. Did not mean to do that. How many different ways can I say accident? Whoa. I guess I can do this. Yeah. I would like to just... Hmm, I guess I should, huh? I know he's got the bishop here, and I'm not thrilled about this position. But... Didn't really see a lot of other choices. Whoa, he goes there? Alright, that's a little weird to me. That was a little weird. Also weird. Oh, right now, now, oh, I should have just taken that pawn. What was I thinking? I really wasn't. Uh, check. Oh. Oh. Danny, what are you doing? You're being an idiot. Oh, move faster. I can't move fast enough right now. I don't know what's wrong with me. God, my mouse was slipping all over the place. Darn it. All right, I'm down two and a half half. Bad chess by me all around. Even in good positions, not playing fast enough. So I got to pick it up. And that's what I'm going to try to do right now. I'm going to try to pick this thing up. That's what I'm going to try to do right here, right now. Because if I get a winning position and I lose on time, it's just there's almost nothing more frustrating, you know? Almost. There are some things more frustrating. Don't you worry your little heart out. Yeah, we're going to blow it open. Blow it open. Go for checkmate. Go for mate. Where's the goods? Do I have any goods? Doesn't look like I have any. 
Anything Hollywood good anyway. Yeah. I had nothing. The whole time. The whole time I had nothing. This time, I would really like to not lose on time. Is that possible? This time, in this particular winning position, I would really hope not to lose on time. Okay. Well, maybe I can make a comeback. He hasn't won the best of five yet. See if I can do something here with this Nimzo. Play something a little bit funkier. Just going to a QGD, you know? Because why not? And why not just make blunders like that? It makes sense to me. Not good for me right now. Certainly not a fan of the way I've been playing this position. But maybe, oh no, that wasn't good. Maybe there's something to it. I don't know. At this point, I just wanted the... Oh my god. I literally just gave him the game. Wow. That is about as bad as I've played here in a little while. Totally unnecessary. Winning position. Up the exchange. And I guess I was up on time. I was so panicked this whole time about my time. So, all right, hats off to Matty D. Perrine. We're going to take off the, take on the next comer here, the legend himself, E. Nosen, who beat me, I think, 6-0 last time. It was pretty bad. That's what I remember. What I remember is that it was really bad. That's what I remember. And if that happens again, we'll not be so happy for sure. He's super fast, this guy. That's kind of his deal, is that he's really, really fast. And so, have to be careful about my time management. Got him. At least I thought I had him. I did have him. But then I gave up my night. <laughs> Hashtag adorable Danny. I don't really know what he was doing with that move. I guess I can go there. Then I get to take this guy and take here. Give check, and then mate. Well, it's nice to win a game, right? It's nice to get on the board after that shellacking I took for Matty D. Perrine. I'm just frustrated about that because I was, like, winning in every game and just being an idiot. You know, if I had remembered my monologue from my role as frightened inmate number two, I probably would have played better. All right, Eno's and wants more. He deserves more. 
He gave me a shellacking last time, a 6-0 shellacking. So anybody that beats me that bad, you know, he pretty much is allowed to rematch me until he's done. You know, what am I doing? I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm being silly. Being silly is what I'm doing. Hashtag being silly. Whoa. Happy. Happy town for me on that. Oop, that's a queen. Should I take there? I like to take with a knight. It doesn't work, eh? I really just want to... I really wanted to just go to Sacktown there. But it just didn't exist. Item 9 exists. It just didn't exist. For me, that time. And now he's beat me on time. As he does exceptionally well. Uh... Okay. Bam. That's what I wanted. This is what I wanted. This is what I needed. I'm going to tell you what. I'm lacking it now. I am lacking it. Whoa. What's he doing there? He's going to give a little check. I see. Does he have anything? I don't know. I don't know what he has here. Does he have something? I'm sure he has something. Uh, time on the ticket, yeah? Oh. Obviously, everyone knows how I feel about that. Everyone knows how I feel about that game right there. Okay? Hashtag frustrated right now. Ugh. <sighs> Play faster. That's his thing. He's so fast, and I can't seem to keep up with him right now, especially while providing commentary. I just really can't. I can't keep... Oh, I should have just taken. What am I thinking? I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm not thinking. That's what I'm thinking. Whoa, happy town. Happy, happy town for this guy. Uh, Fine. It's not necessarily super happy town, but it's it's happy, right? Uh, that's actually not what I meant to do, but it should still be okay. Um, I can take and then give check and then take here. I guess that's probably a winning end game. It is a winning end game, but you know, still need some technique for show. It's going to take some... Whoa. Yeah? Did I just mess up? Big time? Man, that was a tough combination he just busted out. That was tough. I was winning. But not anymore. Maybe with best play, I'd be able to get a draw in a real game. I don't know. Who knows? But not with the time as is as well. All right, well, I got to play best of five at least. I was down 10 seconds again. That's about how much faster he is than me. That's like my 10-second handicap with the uh, with the commentary too, so that was bad. Whoa. 
what's going on here? I would have loved to have done something nastier. But it didn't exist. As far as I could see. Oh, duh. <laughs> I thought he had to dig up the rook. Not a good finish right now to this little mini match we have going. This is some bad chess by me and some great chess by Mr. Enosin. Well, the first game was good. And the second game, probably I should have won too, but lost on time. And so I have to tip my head again to Mr. Enosin. He's just too fast for me. He's just too fast. It's just that simple. And then I'm, you know, look at the time. He knows in you're a stud, man. I got to give it to you. You are a stud, a young candidate master, a very good player. Who else still wants to play? I think we're running out. I think I'm running out of steam after taking that little shellacking by, uh, by Mr. E. Nosen. Oh, Nuki wants a piece of this, huh? Of course he does. Right? Well, there's too many. Nuki, Yakov, Italian Machine, a lot of other players too. All right, Pure Defiance, I see you spammed me. I'm going to give you some love here, buddy. Let's play. Bullet Brawl Sicilian Chichilian. We will play a little Bullet Brawl. All right, we have a Classical Gone Wild, Unrated Edition. Woohoo, Spring Break. All right. Been thinking about giving a little check and going after that pawn here for a while, but I'm not going to. It's too late. I waited too long. Very fast, Mr. Pure Defiance says. Very fast. Uh, I guess so. I guess he says he's playing this way, huh? Oh, that was bad by me. That was bad by me, actually. Really bad, actually. I should have done something different. Well, I guess I can take here now. Yeah, I'm winning. I should have just taken his bishop when it was hanging, so. Not the best chess overall from either one of us here. Uh, we'll push this pawn, I guess. Push it until we can't push it. No mo. All right, buddy. Well, you were you were actually winning there at one point. I, I blundered after you played after I played this horrible d5 move. Um, I think here you should take with check and then take here. Yeah, owie, ouch town, population me, bro. But okay, it didn't happen. All right, I guess we're gonna end this with one fa final best of five brawl. Oh wait. I clicked on the wrong player. I was trying to click on Jakob <laughs> since he's been here the longest. So, okay. Now we got uh, got more hack attack here. Playing against my buddy, Schnert1. That is definitely the character from a Dr. Seuss book. Schnert. I bet Schnert is kind of awesome. I bet he and I would probably enjoy a lot of the same hobbies, too. You know? I bet me and Schnert would get along just fine. Uh, I'm going to do some funsies. Check town. Go here town. I know. I know it may not be the best. I'm aware of the situation, yeah? But not after that. Now it's mate. Mate and bake. Famous mating net. But, um... Yeah, he probably could have, uh... Oh, maybe it is winning. He probably should have played King G6. When in doubt, always play King G6. Hashtag life motto. All right, Yaakov, you are going to be the last brawl of the day here. Let's do it. And I know you're probably just going to beat me 3-0. All right, I'm just going to try to stay on the board with you. 
I'm clearly still struggling with my masochistic tendencies. If you consider that I uh, am ending ending this bullet brawl against somebody who I will surely have tough results against. Yakov always just owns me. Hashtag owned. He really does. He owns me. And I'm not sure there's anything else I can do about it. Honestly, he's just he's just good. Now I mean. Yakov is just good. All right, I guess we'll do that. Uh, I guess we'll kick his queen around. I don't even know what I'm doing here. That wasn't the best of decisions by me, to say the least. Oh, and then I just make it worse. It's because I'm intimidated. I'm intimidated by Yakov. I'll own it. I'll just admit it. I'm just like super intimate by Yako. He just owns me. He's just so much better than me. All right. There you go. All right. Let, let's try to play some real chess, Danny. How about that? How about we try to play some real chess here? Play something like a little bit of a hedgehog here for kicks and gigs. Um, yep. Um, yep or doodle. It's actually okay with me. Probably could have been worse, given how that whole thing started to go down. Alright, we'll go for this. Probably should have taken Wifton Knight. Oh, wait. He can do that. Silly little man. I don't have anything, huh? Well, that's hashtag frustrating. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here right now. Tell you what. Probably I should be fine, but in a bullet game, I'm probably not going to be fine. Given what's likely going to happen. Yep. 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 He doesn't have anything here. I'm actually probably winning now. But it's not so simple as that. Well, now I'm not winning anymore. Ah. Oh. Well, I was down on time, so he gets the credit. He would have won. I was winning. So, good play by me. Right? Good job. Good job. Talking to myself. Good job, Danny. Don't be too intimidated by Yakov next time. Right? I just need to watch Hikaru take Yakov to like, you know, like a 35 to like one and a half kind of like match, you know, where Hikaru just really lays down the smack. And I'll feel like maybe then I'll know that, Hik that Yakov is human. You know what I mean? But as is, I definitely do not score well against this guy. That is the truth. I'm just owning it right now, right? I'm just saying I'm intimidated by Yakov because he's really good. And he always tricks me and does things like that. Just like a big meanie head. <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. Um, all right. What is going on here? I'd like to believe that he blundered. I think he did blunder. I think he has to give up the queen now. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't? <sighs> Weaseling his way out of it again. Oh, I have a bishop. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the bishop. I knew that Black must be losing there. I just, 
I couldn't quite see it. Um, all right, we'll just go back. Hold a tick. No. I just blundered a draw. What is wrong with me? Even when I'm totally winning, I blunder away draws. What? What is he doing? Oh, he's going to beat me on time now? What a, what a meanie head. No. Thank you. You're just beating me on time right now, Yakov. It's just mean. It's mean what you're doing to me. Ugh. Classic Yakov. Of course, I should have pressed draw. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. Um, you know, and also not surprising at the same time. It's the kind of thing that, uh, that goes down here between me and Yakov. Like what you just saw right there, that happens a lot. Okay, so now you understand how I feel. I hope you feel good about yourself, Yakov. You know, I hope you feel real good right now. hope you feel really good. Like, really, I do, actually. I hope, you, hope you're having a good day. I'm serious about that. All right. Well, I got to call it, everybody. I know you're really um, excited to see me lose like this. And how much did I donate today? What was the rating points donation? About 50? 50 to the masses? You're welcome. You know, it'll be uh, next time... Next time, we'll uh, we'll do our best to keep going. I know, you guys, you're spamming me with challenges. I said I'm done, all right? Pure defiance, dude. You already played, man. You know? Get over it, dog. He knows it. I know you just want to abuse me in front of everybody. Dude, hashtag get a life right now, all right? I get it. But, you know, if you want to play when the cameras are off, baby girl, all right? I'm a little bit faster then, I'll tell you that. You might have a little more of a battle there, buddy. All right. Well, some bad chess to end the show today. Yakov, thank you. Everybody else, thank you. And uh, hope you enjoyed the show. And we will see you around later.